Well, happy birthday, Jesus. Sorry your party's so lame. What would you like for Christmas, little boy? I don't know. I, I didn't know you were going to ask me that. Well, what did you think was going to happen? I didn't know. Nobody's ever let me sit on their lap before. All right, just say some toys, please. Uh, can you give me some choices? Because I really don't want to mess up on this list. Damn it, Kevin, come on. What about if I tell you the things I don't want? Okay, yeah, get off, get off. God. Oh, oh, God. I didn't even get to tell you what I wanted. Okay, you know what you get? You get a thousand helium balloons attached to you so Santa doesn't have to go through this again. Awesome. Cancel, we're canceling it. Oh. No, 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 we have to cancel the party. No, 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 we're gonna get fresh for Holly, fresh and new. These cookies are fine. That's not, they're not, Michael, fresh and new. Please Michael, let go. wait, we, Please don't let go. Have, we don't have the budget for another party. Well then everybody will chip in, it'll be fine. I honestly think you're idealizing people here again, Michael. I don't think that's gonna happen. You know what, I'll pay for it, I'll pay for the party. It doesn't matter, this is way too important. People, Holly's coming back, and this is the most important Christmas party of my life, so back to work. I don't ask for much for Christmas. I really don't. It's not like I am begging people to buy me diamonds and brooch pendants. Oh, buy me something expensive or I'm gonna kill myself. That's not, I don't care about that. All I wanna be is Santa. And if you wanna take that away from me, fine. Go ahead. But when you need my help, because I am ruining everything, don't look at me. Behold, Jesus Christ, and I bring to you glad Christmas tidings. I want to remind everyone the true meaning of Christmas. Those of you who wish to join me, that's great. I am excited by that. And those of you who don't, I forgive you. But I never forget. Wow, Michael, like, this must be obvious how wrong this is. Oh, the Antichrist. You can't, ow, you cannot push religion. Oh, but I can push offer. drugs in here, is that what no. you're saying? Oh, yeah. Well, you have to pick one or the other, your choice. Pick your poison, get back to me. In the meantime, I am going to spread my goodness all over this company. I got it. We are going to turn Secret Santa into Yankee Swap. What is Yankee Swap? One person chooses a gift, the next person can either choose a gift or steal that person's gift. If your gift gets stolen, then you can steal someone else's gift or choose a new gift. I thought that was called Nasty Christmas. Yeah, we call it White Elephant. Well, I call it fun. Why are we doing this? Because it's better, because it's more special. It sounds mean. Shut it. Meredith, have you ever used alcohol to alter your mood or deliberately change your state of mind? Sure. Do you sometimes have a drink to celebrate a special occasion or mark a holiday? Obviously. Have you ever, under the influence of alcohol, questioned the teachings of the Mormon church? Where did you get this? I got it on a website. That's not important. Michael, we should contact some experts. You don't know what you're doing. Okay, you know what, Toby? One of my employees is undergoing a crisis, and I wish for just once you would take my side on this. I'm doing your job, man. Hey. Are you texting? Yeah, because this is kind of a drag. Alcohol is a drag, yes. Here's what I'd like to do. I'd like to go around the room and have us each express to Meredith how her alcoholism has affected us. I'll begin. This Christmas party is perhaps the best Christmas party I have ever been to. But then you got so drunk that we had to stop and do this. That's how your drinking affected me. Anybody else? Another time when Meredith's drinking affected you? Come on, people, if we don't say anything, she's not gonna get any better. Yes, Kevin. Well, Meredith, there was that one time that you bought movie tickets, and then you got too drunk to go, so you gave them to me, and that was really cool. That's, you didn't, you weren't hurt by that. Yeah, you said affected by it. Thanks again, Meredith. Okay, no, that's not what we're going for. This just arrived from the Dunder Mifflin Garf Pole Branch. We don't have a North Pole branch, <laughs> idiot. Uh-oh, what's Dwight gonna get? What is it? Yes! Oh, yes, it's space garbage. Dwight's gonna be able to build himself a friend. 
Deck halls <laughs> with crappy And Stanley, gears. Ho, ho, ho. you've been very good this year. I have. Yeah, except for cheating on your wife. Adultery's a sin. Look it up in the Bible, people. What do you get? He got scented candles. Oh, well, that's appropriate. A lot of fire where you're going. <laughs> Better get used to it. You're going to H E L L double hockey sticks. Going to hell, Stanley. <laughs> Amen. And this brings us to you, little one. I can't see from here, people. Somebody shout it out. Don't make me get up. It's fabric. I really wanted this. That's fantastic. You can make another dress that goes past your feet. Andy, was this you? It's a no. secret. Andy no, it was a secret. Aaron. That Michael! You! What? Was I not supposed to stay? What? Turn it back on. What happened? What happened? Toby, what did you do? I think Toby's very jealous of all the attention you've been getting. No, I, I would never ever do anything like that, but it does seem like something you would do. Oh, really? Turn it on me. Well, isn't that nice? Thank you very much. Wait, wait, guys, listen. Toy Story is all about toys that come to life when people aren't looking. You don't think it's not possible that Woody did this to himself? It is Christmas. No, it really seems like something Michael would do. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, the fact that you would think that points to the possibility that it is probably not me and that I have been framed. Why would anyone frame you for that? Okay, I'm sorry. Why are we discounting this whole Woody came to life thing so quickly? Oh, ah! <laughs> oh surprise, it was part of the party. Pretty funny, huh? You think this is funny? <laughs> I don't. But someday I think we will laugh about this when we tell our kids. Yikes. Oh, oh that's oh, that that God. Okay, moving along. Meredith, let's go. I really want the iPod. Okay, okay, okay. It's already been stolen this round. Pick something else. I hope nobody takes this baby because this is great. Wow, look at that fine craftsmanship. Um, and you really put a lot of work into that. It's beautiful. I'll take the oven mitt. See, I wanted somebody to take it. Boom. Reverse psychology. What is this? <laughs> that is my Christmas card. It's a picture of you and me and your kids on a ski trip having a blast. Skis and greetings. No, see, we never went on a ski trip. I know, I know. I went on a ski trip. Right. Two years ago with my kids and my ex-husband. Yes, but what you didn't realize at the time was that I was with you, in a sense. I was in your heart. Michael, and next to your kids. What? This is so weird. I don't understand. It's a bold move to Photoshop yourself into a picture with your girlfriend and her kids on a ski trip with their real father. But then again, Michael's a bold guy. Is bold the right word? I think you're a really sweet guy. Okay. But, um, I don't know how to deal with, with, like, this thing and, and the proposal. And I don't think things are going to work out with no, us. No, 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 OK, OK. You know what? You're not thinking straight. You know what you need? You need to think this through in Jamaica's largest freshwater pool. What are you talking about? I got us tickets to Sandals, Jamaica. We leave day after tomorrow. You had better find the skimpiest bikini oh. there is. Michael. And it's all inclusive. Michael. Yes. I'm sorry. No, Carol, you walk out that door and it is over. I know. Like everybody's attention, Christmas is canceled. You can't cancel a holiday. Give it up, Stanley, and you will lose New Year's. What does that mean? Jim, take New Year's away from Stanley. Michael, what's going on? Carol and I split up amicably. And I just don't think it would be appropriate to celebrate under the circus. Will they still air Rudolph? That's not fair. Are we going to cancel Hanukkah as well? Fine. Have your party. Just no guests. But we invited guests. Well, you know what, fellas? All of your guests would have probably canceled at the last minute. Anyway, leaving your life a stupid rotten mess. 